some pretty impressive numbers across the board this weekend. How pleased are you with your performance? Uh, I can't say how happy I am. Uh, the main thing was just uh, staying focused after that first day and uh, yeah, just get ready for today and, and really uh, I put in a ton of work. So, uh, you know, for that, to, for that to show on paper at the end of the day feels really, really good. And, uh, you know, it definitely helped to have a lot of people back home uh, believing in me. And uh, that helped me come out and believe in myself and really just uh, perform to my abilities and not be nervous. So, you know, when you're on the line and the, the lights are on and everything, it's kind of tough. But, you know, I thought I did well with it. Thanks. Which result are you most pleased with? Uh, you know what? The, the one-on-ones went great. I haven't played since the East-West Bowl, which was last May. So I was really concerned. There's some great receivers here. Uh, you know, they were really impressive numbers and everything. So, and I uh, wasn't too comfortable with press before today, but it went well for me. Uh, I think my one-on-ones were my, uh, my most proud <laughs> thing that happened today. Judging by your scores, you were able to handle the pressure pretty well. How did you do that? Uh, honestly, like I said, it, it was really just the support back home. My mom, my dad, my brother, my sister, and uh, the boys back at 24 Greening and Antigonish. Uh, they love me, so you know that, that helped a lot to stay calm with them all believing in me. And finally, what's been your most memorable moment this weekend? This weekend? Uh, honestly, I met Damon Allen, and that was uh, pretty awesome. I was just kind of walking uh, in the hallway, and I bumped into him, and he was sitting with uh, Jeff Cummins, the coach of uh, Acadia. Anyway, meeting him was pretty awesome, I think. Thanks, Don. All right, thanks.